In my teaching, one of the things that um, I really want to do to accomplish in my teaching is to motivate students to learn. I don't think you can be a very effective teacher if your students are sitting there and they're really not very well motivated to learn. So one of the primary objectives I have is getting them motivated, how to get that started. And I myself am a very visual learner. I learn by seeing things and by doing things. So one of the things in my classes I like to do most is to show images of the material that I'm teaching to try and give the students an experience that they will remember in the classroom. So I teach earth science, so it's very easy for me to um, take pictures and photographs and use those in my own teaching and, and really help the students get um, develop a picture in their mind about what I'm talking about. If the students can understand what you're talking about and they can see it, I think they're far more motivated to try and learn something about that particular area. So using visual images and, and actually trying to create a virtual uh, world inside the classroom that is relevant to the topic that I'm teaching is very important to me in my teaching. So that's one of the things I do is, is trying to motivate students. And in a way, it's, it's a bit like um, trying to take them on a journey. Um, you have to kind of stimulate them and excite them about the prospect of the journey, give them some experiences on the journey, which is in the classroom, and then have them reflect or learn or, or realize what they've learned about the journey, about their experiences in the journey. So um, I, I do try, that's one of the approaches I use in my own teaching, is to use that um, kind of first-hand experience um, using visual aids. The other thing I, I really try to do um, in teaching is to try and make the experiences um, very relevant to the students. Again, that is something that I think motivates students. If they can see a need for that learning or a reason why they should learn, um, I think that really helps motivate them um, in, in the learning process. So making the learning relevant to their own worlds I think is really important too. So rather than this kind of um, really esoteric subject that really doesn't have much real meaning to their real lives, it, it's very difficult to, to have students learn about that. But if they can see that it's connected to their own worlds in some way, I think uh, that helps them learn, stimulates the learning.